Hello viewers and welcome to this video tutorial. We are going to learn how can we create a computed column using a user defined function. So we'll use we'll first create our user defined function. Uh, I already have code written over here. So I am going to execute this code. Let's first create the function that we'll call in our columns code. Uh, I am executing right. Okay. I am considering that you already know about the determinism concept. Uh, this function is definitely non-deterministic as I am not using schema binding keyword over here. So this function is created. Let's test this function. I just took an input integer and doubled the value and returning the output. So let's alter this table. You will notice that I cannot make this column persistent. Uh, what this will do when I run this command, I'll get an error. Computed column double cell in table jobs cannot be persisted because the column is non deterministic. Let us see, explore the jobs. You know, I already have a column salary. I'm just, I just want to take salary as an input and will double the output. So why can I can I not make it persisted is because this function is non-deterministic. To make it deterministic, we will need to create the same function with a schema binding keyword. So for now, let's remove this persisted keyword from here and let's re-execute the code. Now you can see my column is created. Uh, let's select the output. Okay, you can see double salary column is created but it is not a persisted column this will compile this will uh, calculate the values every time it is referenced in any query and it will just double the salary thousand converted to two thousand five thousand converted to ten thousand now let's explore how can we make this column persisted this is definitely a computed column but it will not store the values so this is a query that we usually use to know what the status of our function is, whether it is deterministic or non-deterministic. For this video tutorial, I am considering you already know what is the concept of determinism. Over this function, my func is not deterministic. So let's create a deterministic function. Uh, I am executing this code. You see, with the schema binding keyword is used over here. This is tell SQL server that um, if the same number uh, same values of input is provided the output will remain same every time provided the same conditions of database so let's create this function right okay I'm executing the same uh, query again to know whether my function has been considered as deterministic yes it is now if I try to add the same column I'm just uh, I'll just create the same column by using the my det function with a salary to column name okay now you'll notice my this column is created and this is considered as persisted column this will store the value this is good for the SQL server performance okay now let's select now you can see the same column uh, with a double underscore salary to is created but the base difference between these two columns is that this column is not persisted this column is persisted it will store the data in on the disk and it will not be recalculated every time it is called in the query okay it will only be uh, calculated when the input column salary is changed but this will be calculated every time so this column is also based on user defined function but the function used behind this column is non-deterministic that's why you couldn't make this column persisted i hope this makes you sense if you got uh, if you've got any question you can definitely write me in comments i will surely try to answer your questions at my earliest thank you so much take your time